Hey, hustlers, come on in. Bring your Kool-Aid, your water, your cocktail, and your food and snacks. Come on in, y'all. We're going to talk a little bit, just, just for a little bit. All right, y'all. Let's say prayers. Father God, I just want to uh, uh, pray for um, the family of um, Trina. She has lost her life with cancer I bless I mean I ask that you uh, give them strength uh, the mamas and the sisters as they go through their loss bless uh, Ukraine and Russia let your will be done order our steps in your word and have your way in our lives, Father, and give us strength to endure till you come home and come back, Lord. Mm -hmm. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and blessed body, Father. Thank you. I love you. Yeah. I was looking for a recipe for shrimp and red potatoes. I found it on Google. I did exactly what they told me to do, and look how good that looks. I'm ready to taste it. I have not tasted, y'all. I have some uh, seasoned uh, um, cucumbers right here, and of course, y'all, we, we got the cocktail. It's Saturday. And uh, on the side, I have some ranch dressing and some uh, red hot. I don't know if I want it. I don't know which one I want on here, but I, I probably going to want something. Uh, yeah, so let's dig in, y'all. Oh, let's toast. Ha-ha, <laughs> for a good night. Mm-mm, we love. Salud, salud. Let's sip, sip this good food stuff. Cheers, hustlers. How is your day going? I hope it's good. Now, for me, um, I really want these cucumbers, though, y'all. And I don't know, mm. Mm. I put some uh, salt, pepper, and a pinch of sugar. Mm. I don't know if I want to tell you this ranch dressing. Now I'm not big a big ranch dressing on my salad, you know. Let's put that on the side, and we can dip, baby, dip. Dip, baby, dip. My day is, uh, I mean, it's going really well. Um, <laughs> I was in, in the office this morning and I was going to do something. And before I knew it, I was out, I was down there talking two hours. Yeah, I like those girls, some of them. Mm, mm, mm. I really like that ranch on my... I like Italian dressing. It just tastes different. But anyway, y'all, um, I was down there talking to the girls, the ladies, not girl, <coughs> ladies. Oh, that pepper. <clears throat> we had some good conversations going. And uh, let's taste these potatoes, y'all. Red potatoes in the oven. I, I cut up some tomatoes, some red bell peppers, some red onions, some fresh garlic. And then I seasoned it with uh, garlic powder. Uh, cumin, Spanish paprika, salt and pepper, olive oil. I think that's it, y'all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's that tomato under there, y'all. This is good. Mm. This is the first time I did uh, shrimp in the oven. I followed their recipe, y'all, but they, they cook really well. Look at that. So, y'all, I knew I had to go to Harris County Kroger and get my tag for my car until I changed my driver's license and all that other stuff. But my insurance is in my 
new uh, address. And y'all know what I learned today. For the market rate of what uh, they gave us until we retire, they raised it $300. And everybody that already signed out their papers, they are not happy. They had to call them all, y'all. That's bad business. So, they are going to lose a lot of money every day. I just think people are money hungry today. Greedy, if I should say that. That's just wrong, y'all. I'm glad I I signed mine before then. Mm, oh, my God. Well, y'all know I'll season my shrimp like I do. And I let it sit for maybe three hours in the refrigerator. That's good. And it's so tender. So I asked them, you know, because I don't want to move no more, y'all. I was like... When my year is over and it's for renewal, is it going to go up to $1,400? Mm-mm. People just doing the most these days, you know? We're not in control of what goes on because we have to go through the stuff. We, we really do. But I think right now people are price gouging. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-mm. Y'all y'all know I don't like that skin. Mm. Mm. I wish I had put some Italian dressing in here. But uh it's amazing what people do for money. What had a song a long time ago? What people do. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know I can't sing, so I don't know the tune. But it was a song back in the day. About that. Y'all see I'm still going over there to get my drink. So. All these elders who are uh, putting their notice to move. Mm -hmm. Who knew? Now, what I ha what I will say, because y'all know I'm not uh, salt heavy. I can use a little bit more salt. Mm -hmm. But the roasted flavor is really good with them tomatoes and red bell pepper and red onion. And olive oil is okay. Next time I'm going to do olive oil and butter because I will definitely keep this on my menu. Mm -hmm. It's good. So anyway, I was behind time because uh, I want to be across that bridge before that traffic, y'all. The weekend traffic, you know. So... It was one of the leasing office um, uh, agents that she wanted to go. I said, well, come on, jump in the Blue Angel. So, went across the bridge and we did a little shopping at the grocery store. Then we went to the fresh market, y'all, because, you know, I wanted my blue crabs and my shrimp. Guess what, y'all? No blue crabs. None. Not one. So, I had to do, our, of course, my shrimp and some tilapia. And it's amazing, y'all. Y'all know I've been going to that, that place. Because on that street, y'all, remember I told you it's seven different places that you can go to get your fresh uh, uh, seafood. 
And the one I picked, I just like it, you know? I like the customer service. But when that man saw me standing there, he said, and it was like maybe seven or eight people at that register. He got my shrimp, he got my fish, he cleaned my fish, he bagged me up, put my ice in it. And when I when I looked up, he was telling me to come out to the front and pay for my food. I'm like, oh goodness. Mm, all right, you're gonna get me beat up in here. He always do that every single time for the four years I'll be at. When you are nice to people, mm. people are nice to you. It does come back at some point, you know. Y'all, these shrimp are good. Mm hmm. It's so soft and moist. And then I let, oh, I let the potatoes bake for like 20 minutes. And then I switched them up. And then I grab my shrimp and put them, you know, single layer between the potatoes. And I cook it for uh, eight more minutes. And this is what you get. Potatoes cooked. Great, but y'all see, I, I cut my potatoes a small and even so they can all cook together. Y'all see the size of that potato? Mm hmm. One thing about it, y'all know I like uh, potatoes. <laughs> I wish these was the yellow ones. Mm. But they not. I would definitely do this meal again. Most definitely. So anyway, y'all, we got back and in our common area, we have a pool table. And I used to shoot pool back in the day. I'll be the first to say I'm rusty. I went to go shoot some pool after I got back. After I, you know, washed all my seafood up and bagged it up and put it in the freezer. Uh, I, I'm rusty, but I, I put the ball, balls in the hole. Yeah. We need some uh, chalk. We don't have no chalk. Mmm. That tomato was good and sweet, gal. I probably need some more potatoes because I think I got more shrimp than I do potatoes. Mm hmm For some reason, y'all cannot do that skin. And my teeth and tongue know that. <laughs> These shrimp are really good. So anyway, y'all, that's how my day went. So... After this, I'm going to do some Pandora music. And last night, y'all, when, when I did it, I only had one drink. Only one last night. I don't know what's going to happen tonight. Because there's really nothing good on TV right now. Mm-hmm. I put basil in my shrimp. That tastes good. I can taste the, I can taste the seasoning from these shrimp. Mm-hmm. Tomorrow, y'all. At the church. It's just too many shrimp on here. Um, I'm going to do a Louisiana dish I saw on uh, Facebook. It's called Shrimp Penguin. I, I know I'm standing wrong from a Louisiana folk, but uh, I'm definitely going to do that. But but I'm going to add some a couple of andouille sauces in it, though, y'all. And if you ask me, it's like shrimp creole. Yeah. It's 
going to be good, y'all. And I bought some fresh corn. Y'all, fresh corn is absolutely overpriced. I, for four uh, years of corn, fresh corn, I paid $5.49. I wish I could show y'all how big it is. But what I did find that I was trying to find for three, four months, my grits. I found my grits today. Mm-hmm. I was so excited. As I told y'all, sometime in the morning, I just want a bowl of grits. Mm-hmm. I'm just pouring those potatoes. will fill you up. Y'all really, oh, my thought just came in my head. Pray for Ukraine and Russia. And the Braxton family, you know, they, they lost, they lost a, a loved one, you know. All of us gonna have to go home at some point. Mm -hmm. All of us. Y'all did not stop my clock. Mm -mm. I don't know how long I've been talking. I've been talking for a while because I'm almost done eating. <laughs> so let's do 10 minutes. I guess. I don't know. But the Braxton's family, they lost a loved one. We all have a time to live and we all have a time to go. But when we see people who have lost a loved one, pray for the family because they're going to need it, you know? Yeah. Because none of us know when we're going to go. But I hope you guys got y'all stuff in order. I do. My sister, if if, uh, if I die before her, she got all my information. And she did tell me. She said, sister, you send it to me and I've never opened it. You're going to have to open it, honey. My heart is sad for the Braxton's family, you know. And she kept her journey of cancer private, and that's especially what she had to do. You know, want everybody in, in your business. Yeah, it's something. It really is. I don't know why I keep thinking about it. Because we watched them a, a long time, you know? Well, not all of us, but some of us did. Excuse me. Mm. I would never put ranch on my cucumbers again. Ever. But they were seasoned so well, y'all, so I'm going to eat them. I only got four pieces of them. So. And I only did a half of a cucumber. So tomorrow I cut the other half and I eat it with my shrimp pinguam. <laughs> I know that's not how, how you say it. Mm -hmm. That's good. Just a little bit more salt, y'all. To your liking.
Mm. Mm, so well. Those shrimp are bomb. I taste every piece of seasoning, y'all. That's good. I was gonna do some uh, garlic shrimp or pasta. I'm like, no, nah, because I know potatoes ain't no better because I'm gonna be eating some rice. You know, you gotta put your shrimp creole over your rice. But I don't know how to cook a little spaghetti though, so it would have been way too much. I only cut up four potatoes, so. It's not too bad. I gotta take that out of there. I don't want that in there no more. It's only two. I, don't, I do not want that ranch. Mm -mm. That's disgusting. <laughs> really. I know a lot of y'all like ranch a thousand island or whatever side dressing y'all like. But one thing I want to try, I look at lips and somebody else, they, they have that uh, salt and vinegar salt that they put on their cucumbers. I've never had that before. I don't know if I like it. But I, I want to try it. So tell me where to buy it, y'all. He did say it's at BW's, but I never go to BW's ever. But number one, I don't like that chicken. I pick Wingstop over BW's and Hooters, especially Hooters. Hooters got some, mm. They wings are just nasty. I think they need to revamp something. Cause there's a Hooters in Seabrook that's never crowded. You know, one thing I know people love, especially during game time, is some good chicken wings. You gotta, you, you, they chicken wings suck. Really bad. Mm-hmm. It's bad. So I got a potato and a shrimp, y'all. And I'm breathing hard. <laughs> mm-hmm. Our weather was pretty today. Now I'm babbling, y'all. Mm -hmm. Oh, I am so full. But what the hell? You can't leave one potato and one shrimp. Let's do it. <sighs> mm. We can lead them to cucumbers because you know they got that ranch dressing on it. <laughs> we don't have to eat that. But you can't waste this good food. That red skin just don't like me and I don't like it. Y'all, but they didn't put um, t tomatoes in there. So I just, I had some beautiful little red small uh, tomatoes. And um, I just put in there. It made a difference, though. Them potatoes are good and sweet when you cook them. When they burst, mm -hmm. they really are good. Y'all, we done, honey. Almost like a Sunday. Uh-oh, excuse me. Almost like a Sunday meal. Because y'all know that's the only meal I finish. It's my Sunday after church meal. Mm -hmm. Y'all remember I showed y'all two videos ago? Y'all haven't seen it yet. But, but maybe. Maybe you have. These that uh, Bucky sell. Y'all look at that. If y'all ride in Texas and you see a Bucky's, 
Please stop. Oh, I, when I was uh, done uh, shooting pool, a lady joined me at the table because I was sitting down and she, she's she been here for one week. And she's 74, I think she says. She looks so good. But we happened to get on a subject of Bucky's and I we, we found out that we both love Bucky's. She said she hoped to see me down in the common area again and I said, you will. I'm going to get back on my thing of shooting pool. Mm -hmm. And then go to the hole in the wild and whoop some butt at 59 years old. Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. Maybe I meet a, 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 a semi-good person bending my ass across the pool table trying to hit a ball. <laughs> Let's sing, y'all. Y'all ready? Hey. Cheers. To good night. It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance around. On the other side. So whatever y'all do for the rest of this evening, do it good. Y'all can y'all can say it with me. Do it good. Do it with purpose. And do it with what? Genuine wine love. Peace out, hostess. Cheers. <laughs>